Hello everybody, hope you're doing well. Welcome to another video. This is, I think, the second Friday video, unless something happens later on in the world of the forums. Uh, but this one's going to be about uh, just some guides around some of the objectives. Should have got this out maybe yesterday, but I tell you what, with Winter of Woe, so many other things going on, it can be very relentless all of a sudden uh, with, with things. But I'm hoping next week with uh, Act 8.3 things... Um, Act 8.3? No future 8.4 um you know it's different you know some some new vibes hopefully some new things announced i'm looking forward to finding out whether or not we're getting the gwenpool bubble blowout or the spring cleaning 2024 but look you've got some objectives in game at the moment whether or not it's kind of doing the maze keys you may have already smashed it out you may have not uh so first of all uh maze keys wise uh just search, and this is my top tip, in order to reduce down energy costs of stuff, search Moo124, just like that, and it comes up with Moo124. And then what you'll be doing this week is just dueling this champion with a mutant-based champion. Like, uh, you know, I've got their uh, Iceman, but I would say any mutant will do. Uh, preferably one that's not going to harm... Uh, when you hit them, so uh, I'll just pick Gambit, and what we'll do is we'll get hit. The reason you're looking to get hit is up to an SP three, uh, and it's mainly because well, not it's it's um uh with no actually it, it's it's fine because Hulk is actually in the crystal, so we will talk about how this kind of you know covers a different objective. So there's a regicide solo event now. Uh, you know, you just watch the screen right here, and SP3, throw an SP3, boom, done, right there. And we'll just skip that, okay. Uh, so that's the it's castling objective, which I'm referring to, which is uh, this one uh, right here. I'll just get the arrow in to there. Uh, so castling solo objective. Now, I've done that already. Um, I mentioned it briefly in how the SideQuest works based video, uh, but that will be something that, of course, will be here in game in the objectives uh, sector. In the solo events, uh, solo events area, uh, as I mentioned, there is something called regicide and there's in chest the pawns go first. Now, we'll talk about regicide. You can see I've got 5,000 100 points. Now, I just picked up that last 100 points for Regicide because it's defeated champion who is featured in the Hail to the King Crystal using SP3 as the last hit in any mode, exclude practice mode. So it's all about doing hand in hand. Like, I use the Mutant, it's part of the objective this week, cancelling, of course, different objective, different weeks. And of course, did it, um, you know, in tandem, as I said. If you're doing Regicide in general, you can go to your Crystal section and then look on Hell to the King, which is that one there. Read off some of the champions to use, or use against, sorry. Uh, the Overseer, Mojo, Red Skull, Dormammu, Modok, um, loads of them. My personal recommendation, well, I, I, I would say go and do arena and only do sp3s to end the fights and there's a high chance that you'll do it for free without any kind of worry now i'm on a different ilk like if i'm doing something like writing up a guide or i'm, I'm working on stuff washing the dishes um i don't know having a bath brushing my teeth whatever i'll probably leave the game auto fighting on or what i would recommend for this is going to uh act two Point five, which is uh, this one right here, and you're looking out for the unstoppable right there. All notes and information can be found in the link in the description. It will take you to the, this guide right here. Uh, but as I said, my my recommendation is two point five. It is a two energy cost, whether or not you like it or you do not. This is the team that I set up right here. It's centered around Hyperion. Hyperion being a champion that easily gets to power and gets to an SP three very very quickly. And again, similar pre premise to what we just saw right there was that I just go to Thor and this Thor fight here because the champion's within the crystal it costs two energy look at it from this way oh that waste energy wouldn't it rich well you do arena uh if you want to do it by this way then it's 70 energy uh you know put it in half what is that that's right 35 so that's 35 fights you only have to do it 50 times so within two days or even less than that as i said if you if you do it by doing duels as well you'll have that smashed out really easily um I, in a less than a day it 
Oh, and again, use Arena. As I said, it's probably one of the best routes to use with it. And yeah, I'll just be using the likes of Hyperion, and we'll see in a second. I've put a power gain team on, so having Black Widow, Winter Soldier, Hawkeye, it just helps out quite a bit to the ramp up of power. So you can see right here, uh, or in um, incursions might work. I don't know, I'm always a bit iffy about incursions. But yeah, like as you can see, I'm just building up now to the SP3, and then we're just gonna, we're gonna hit, get hit by a special attack ourselves. Uh, and then just throw the SP3 right there. And then it will just be over and done. So that's that particular quest right there. I'm finding this is the most kind of like easiest way doing it, but I think there's probably like other ways that are more easier. Hey, I'm just presenting you an option. You can see now that it's gone up. Uh, regicide in chest pawns go first. It's gone up, uh, but in a chest pawns in a chest uh, in chest the pawns go first. Uh, I would say with that one, it's probably best to do road to labyrinth. You could use a similar method. It looks like we kind of like we got some extra points, but I would personally just go. I'm going to Road to Labyrinth, which, of course, we know how to get to. And in Road to Labyrinth, I would break out my uh, Summon Symbiote. So there we go, round one. And then what we do is edit team. We go down to one stars, because here's the thing. You've got to use one stars. So we're just going to pop in the Summon Symbiote. Summon Symbia, um, or you could have a team of one stars, it's, it's up to you. But Summon Symbia is a lot more stonkier and chonkier than other ones. And you can literally just like just blast the champion through this particular content and it'll just go from start to finish and just smash that out. Uh, and of course, you know, it's it's up to you how again, it's always up to you how you approach content, what you want to use. I've presented an option right there of how you want to do it. Um, do bear in mind, as I'm finding out, there's People that were below Paragon, I think, got very different ones to this. They got a long kind of root of them. So, uh, so yeah, that's really it. Uh, and that's uh, the um, objectives and solo event guide for this month. Of course, they do improve. They do the new ones come in weekly. Look out for that. We'll just kind of update them on the spreadsheet. Check out the spreadsheet. With the link to which is in the description down below. Have a lovely day and bye bye for now.